Silly season has now started in FC24, guys. And if you are enjoying the content and you appreciate this review, please leave a like on today's video. Kingsley Coman, 91 is here. Let's put him into a team and let's review him. Are you tired of coming up against absolutely insane teams? Well, today I've got a solution for you. Welcome to LootBar.gg, the fastest, safest, and most reliable, as well as cheapest coins I have seen for FC24. You can receive your coins as fast as 30 minutes, and also they offer full refunds if you're not happy with the product. Here is me making an order of 100,000 coins. As you can see, as we go across to the game, I've only got 489,000 coins. I also got a message from the customer service team and they told me exactly what I need to do to get my coins. And there we have it guys, just like that, in about 20 minutes I have received my 100,000 coins. Not only that, they offer 24 seven customer support, so if you do need help with your order, you are in good hands. You can also trust lootbar.gg with a 4.6 rating on Trustpilot and absolutely amazing reviews, which you can see right now on your screen. So if you want to upgrade your team on FC24, make sure you go to lootbar.gg, link in the description. Okay guys, this card is very, very expensive. Starting off with an 89, it's got two 88s, two 87s, no, 187, an 86, and an 84. So, not a cheap card. He's 5 star, 5 star, high medium, 5 foot 11, mostly explosive. In terms of play styles, he's got ping plus, which is very good on forwards. Rapid plus, flare, first touch, acrobatic, relentless, and quick step. His alternates aren't the best. Comes out as a left mid, but can play right mid and left wing, interestingly. But for me personally, this card's perfect. Right? I've got a lot of Bundesliga players in my team. I've still got this Marlin in my team. I've got Timothy of Frimpong, Kimmich, of course, another very, very good SBC. And, you know, five star, five star is crazy on a card like this. I believe he's five free on his gold card. In terms of in games, this looks a bit like a buddy's card. I can't even lie. It's got great pace, really good shooting, a bit on the long shots and finishing. But outside of that, really good shooting. Very good passing for an attacker. 92 vision, 91 crossing, 90 short pass, 85 long pass, and 94 curve. It's absolutely mental. His dribbling stats are very good across the board. Good agility and balance. Very good reactions, ball control and dribbling. The only thing that lacks a little bit here is his composure down at 83, which is quite low in my opinion. And then we've got, you know, he's got okay jumping with 93. Poor head and accuracy, but he might win a little bit in the air. He is 5'11". His stamina has been juiced up massively, which is good. And he does have Relentless, which is very, very crucial for this card. I believe he has very low stamina on his gold and even his versus card. He's also got very good strength for this kind of player as well. Chem style for him, in my opinion, is going to be a Hawk. Now, the reason I like the Hawk on this card, first of all, you can't boost composure. So there's no point even really boosting the dribbling. I think it's already really, really good. The Hawk gives him a pace boost. Up to 99 acceleration and 95 sprint speed. So going to like 97, 98 pace. Goes up to 98 attack positioning, 91 finishing. 99 shot power and 92 long shots. Which is a very, very good boost in the shooting department. In my personal opinion. 99 jumping as well with 84 strength. So a very, very good boost. And this card does look absolutely bonkers. You know, it's just a crazy card. We're going to play him on getting behind and stay forward. As the right centre forward in the 4 3 2 one Also, before we do get into the gameplay here... I do have Socrates on the bench. Here's the next player we will be reviewing. But guys, let's get into a few games with Komen and see what he can do. Okay, guys, bringing you in live now. This guy's quite sweaty. So it's going to be a bit of a quieter game probably for me. Win that, please. He has won it. Oh. Oh, it's a beautiful finish as well. I don't know why he hit that with his left foot. He is right footed, isn't he? What a strange shot. I mean, it doesn't matter. You know, he's got the five-star weak foot, I know. But that seemed like a really, really weird way to shoot there. I don't, I don't think he needed to do that, but we're one up. Here we go. Nice. Coleman. We're going to go back into him here as well. Ping pass. Nice. The ping pass on attackers, guys, is very, very tasty. Oh, is that a pen? It is. Coleman's won a penalty as well, guys. The ping pass plus on attackers is going to go down a treat. I'm already going to tell you guys I like this card. I like this card a lot. Good pen as well from him. We're 2-0 up. Against a good player. Get this SPC completed if you kind of want to play to the meta. Because that right there, that ping pass stuff, is going to be OP. For cutbacks as well. We're freeing it up. It's an assist for Komen, guys. This dude's going to leave. Let's get into another game. Okay, guys. Second game now coming up with Komen. What a first game that was. What a first game that was. And I think the important thing to say is a card like this, 
just fits the meta. It, it's, it's an upgrade to your team, unless you've got like the team of the years up there. He, he feels really, really fast. He feels strong as well. And it is now silly season in FC24, right? It's, it's now the time where we're going to get SPCs that will change your team. Ping pass. Yeah, there you go, guys. I'm telling you. I'm, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, guys. This is going to be a crazy good card. Crazy good. For, everybody's going to have this one. I'm telling you. And you should complete him. And he's got this rapid as well. If we can... Nice. It's a nice play. His passing, just generally, is amazing. It's really, really nice. He is again. He's read me that time. He doesn't have technical, does he? Which is a bit sad, actually. I don't think he does have technical, which ruins him a little bit for, like, kind of slot. I need to say this carefully. Slaloming into the space. You can still do it. There you go. That's that's it being done a little bit there. And you've got so much time with him because he's got the rapid as well. This card feels like a cutback merchant in Mbappe. I don't know if that makes any sense. But he feels like Mbappe, if Mbappe was able to do really good cutbacks... You know, obviously the ping pass again. Really does show up trumps on a card like this. It really, really does, guys. Here we go with him again here. We're going to play him in here. Nice. Oh, no, I've not done that. That was just step overs. It was just step overs. Nice, Kanji. That Kanji as well, guys. There have been some crazy good SBCs as of late, haven't there? Nice. Oh, not really felt his strength there. He doesn't feel weak, but... And I suppose maybe his body type is a little bit slender. Go on then. Find it. Oof. Bit unlucky. Now, you can either go for cutbacks like that, guys. Or you can kind of drive right down to the byline and look for it. Either or, though, are going to work so, so well. Nice from a kanji there. This guy likes a cross, doesn't he? This guy really does like a cross. I'm impressed with this card, though, already. I am. Okay. Okay, I see what this guy is. He's an aerial plus merchant. There's nothing wrong with that. I, I am a bit of an aerial plus merchant as well. Go for Ingpon. Nice. In there as well then. Here he goes. We can sprint boost into the space here as well. Because he's got the rapid. Bang. Oh, I feel like that should be a better shot there. I'm not going to complain too much. But I feel like that should be a better strike. And that should at least be testing the goalkeeper. Just due to, you know, it's green timed. He's not got bad shooting. But maybe this card is more of a an assister than it is a goal scorer. As we've kind of seen already, right? He's been very, very good at providing assists in this game. I'm well, not in this game per se, but wow, what a ball. Is he keeping that in too? He's going to have to knock it backwards. Oh. I do think, guys, if, if you play with wide players, I think you'll all, all really like this card because, you know, getting down to the byline, having the five-star, five-star... Allows you to, you know, you can, you can pass on both feet. But not only that, you can do a skill move to, to beat a player as well. As I haven't really showcased yet. Nice. Let's, let's, let's find him again. Come come short, come short, come short. Nice. You drive here. Look for the ball roll. And there you go. Every time, you're getting a chance. You're going to get a chance, guys, with that. Almost every time. This, this is a good card. This is a power curve card. Pusher. If that makes any sense. You know, it feels like a card that will get into your team. It really, really does. Nice. Try into that space then. That's good play. Now, another thing for this card, guys, is that everybody's got Davies. Everybody's got Kimmich. And most people play with them in their main teams. I have to say, I am quite impressed. I am quite impressed with this card in EA, generally, with this promo. Winners, winners. Yeah, he's good in the air, man. He is actually quite good in the air. He's making this run here, too. It's a really good run. Does well as well. Coleman. Oh, Kingsley. Set it off to Marlon. No, why have I not scored there? What I will say about him, guys, if there's one con, is his dribbling doesn't feel as good as I probably thought it was going to. He feels a little bit like the touches seem a little bit heavy. That's nice, though. Well, that is nice. Shoot. Yeah. Mm. I don't think his shooting's bad. I don't think I've had the right angles really in the game. And, and I am looking at this card very much as like a cutback merchant. Oh, that is unlucky, isn't it? Go, Coleman, go. Nice. 
Got to wait for his run as well. See if we can find that ball in there. Is he? Oh, I think he's offside, isn't he? Wow. He is super, super, super fast. Um, touches seem a little bit heavy at times, which is weird because he's got really good dribbling and really good dribbling place holds. I think he's got first touch, right? I don't really understand why his dribbling feels like a little bit heavy and lethargic. That is, that is a con, though, definitely. He's got plenty of acres to drive here, though. He's getting caught up by Sauer, which is crazy. Is he going to win that back? It's a foul, apparently. I mean, yeah. Doesn't feel as strong as I thought he would and has really strange dribbling. Nice. That's better from Cohen. You want to utilize the sprint boost as much as you can. <clears throat> nice, nice. Nice. Oh, my Lord. Coming again here. Ping pass. Oh, Jesus. This guy's lucky. It's nice. That is a good pass as well. I thought I aimed it. Coming again. Nice. Oh, we're getting so unlucky. Final pass is rigging me here. Not even from Coman. That's nice. That's nice. And that's a good goal as well. I mean, that was an absolutely crazy bit of build-up there. We lost the ball so many times and dispossessed him again so quickly. Nice. It, he does, like, not pick up the positions I thought he was going to. This might sound like a bit of a negative review, guys. It's not. I'm just trying to get to, to kind of grips with him because, you know, he, he, he is good. He is absolutely good. And he's bloody expensive as well. Look at that. Now, that for me, guys, is the value in the card. Right there. The ping passes with him, because he's more advanced than your midfielders, means you really do get another kind of outlay off the... What? Out of this card that you don't... You have never really experienced before. You know, this is a playstyle plus as in the attack is different because we haven't had it yet before, really. Um, there might be a few players that have had it. I'm just trying to think off the top of my head if they have, but I don't think so. I don't think so. And this guy's put the pad down. So, yeah, there you go. Okay, guys, my review is in on 91 Fup Birthday Kingsley Coman. This card is awesome. It's a power curve push card, right? He is very unique because, to my knowledge and experience of playing this game and reviewing cards on this game, there are hardly any players that have ping pass plus and are a forward player. You're used to having this in your midfield, Kimmich, um, Herrera. Just to name a few, I don't really know all of them. Modric as well. Modric is 93. And what Komen offers with the ping pass is incredible passing across the box. Cutbacks as well. And because it's so easy to get into them positions, because he's got rapid plus and quick step, it's amazing to play with. It's a shame that he doesn't have more play styles. It's a shame he doesn't have a shooting one. Um, it's a shame he doesn't have technical as well, I have to say. This card isn't all uh, sunshine and roses, right? As I say, the play styles aren't actually that good on him. The shooting is good, but it's not spectacular. Not that this card really is a card that you should be scoring a lot of goals with. You should be making a lot of assists with this card. And that's what he's good at. He is super fast. He's got a five-star weak foot as well with five-star skills, which means you can bob and weave in and out without doing technical, which is the way a lot of people that don't do skill moves try and bob and weave out. And of course, this card can't do it. So if you know how to utilize skill moves, that is the way you kind of substitute the, the no technical play style. And, you know, the five-star weak foot is so good for passing and shooting as well. Um, his passing is incredible. His passing is absolutely incredible. And it really does change the level of card we're used to on this game, guys. He is brilliant. He is brilliant with his pace. Decent shooting. Crazy, crazy good passing. Good physicals as well for the kind of player he is. He's not bad in the air. And his physical is okay up against the women fullbacks and some of the, the men fullbacks as well. The only thing I was a bit disappointed with was his dribbling. And I think it's because he's got rapid plus. He doesn't feel like he's got close to 99 pace. He feels like he's got 90, which is still fast. It is still fast. Um, but it also impacts his dribbling. He doesn't feel as... Sticky on the left stick and as I thought he was going to. He doesn't sprint boost as well as I thought he was going to. 
but he is still super fast and really good on the dribble. And you just have to get used to him a little bit more. He's a very powerful wide player. And I think he suits like right mid or left mid a lot more than he does right centre forward in a 4 3 2 1. I also think you could play this card as a cam, a middle cam, or, you know, a ram or lamb in a 4 3 2 1. I do think, guys, that this card is a meta push. And I actually think if you don't have the team of the year forwards, this card probably does make your team. I think he's absolutely brilliant. He is going to get a 9.5 out of 10 from me. And I think the value is bad. But I promise you, this card is very good in game and very unique. And it's hard to stop with all of the things that he does have going for him. Guys, if you have enjoyed today's video, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the bell to play review. But guys, that is going to be it for me for now. So take care.